What's going on everybody? It's your boy Lando Sess. Hope all is well. In this video, we're going to talk about some good old mana because good old Decentraland been popping and going crazy lately. We're going to talk about is it going to keep rising or should it start consolidating and going down? So first is looking at this article. It's a mana about to break the bearish rising red wedge will bills will the bulls sustain all right the central land was trading at 72 cents when the market's open for trading however it shortly it shortly tanked into the red zone and reaches lowest of 64 cents on the first day of the week although during the course of the day mana found some momentum as the bulls drove the price and higher in the red zone until the second day during the midday the third day mana formed the head of a shoulder pattern its left shoulder was at 68 cents in the red zone furthermore the tip of the head formed the green so let me show you what they're talking about they don't actually fully have the chart how i want it so if we look at it i can show you guys my self all right so if we look at mana and the last day last day has been in the red haven't been too much momentum not too much growth you go back the last week it was at 70 cents it was at 74 so the last week you're up five percent you're not doing nothing crazy but you go to last month you see 30 cents all the way to 74 cents that's well over double that's insane now you look at it over here five percent the last month 151 percent the last year still down 70 72 percent that's the crazy part about it so what we're looking at in this video is we're looking back the last year and we're zooming in to this point this point and right here where we at so this point was at 71 cents. We're just going to say 70 cents. This is what we was looking for of reaching 70 cents. We seen it do it right here. So it literally go right here. And it's the resistant level. The resistant level went from 70 cents to right about to like 74. And you see it came back down and went all the way. Well, it went up, went up to 80. And went back down to what we had 74 right here. So the goal is what it's trying to do is get past this 80 cents, really from 80 to like 84 cents. Once mana hit 84 cents, it's gonna shoot up and it's gonna go over to a dollar if it hit it. So your main thing you're looking for is mana to hit 84 cents, a little bit over 80, and that's when you know the bullish signs is gonna completely explode. But such as the short term, where can we go back down to? We can go back down to 66 cents, 65 cents, 65 cents around there. What would happen? I don't necessarily know. Nobody next, nobody knows until we get close to it. But we always have to expect for the worst sometimes. But really when it's going down like this, I mean, it'll probably go down like 67, 69 and trade sideways for a while. So next you want to look at is competition. The closest thing to mana is Sandbox. Sand is, is their cousins at this point. You've seen the last week down 4.6 over here. Let me delete some of these. Uh -uh. Last week up 5%, down 5%. Last month up 89% versus 150%. Last year down 81 versus 70 something. So they're real close on how well they are trading together. So let's look at the volume over here. The difference is look at this volume is at 174 million. Why this volume is at 228. Still not too different. The circulation 1.9 billion. 1.5 billy market cap 1.1 1.4 so they're really doing the same thing whole time 82 days versus 23 now the difference is with sandbox the only difference you've seen 
was a whole time because people buy it and use it. Whether the games is different or they don't believe in a project, mana you buy and hold and show their games is probably have a different strategy than them. So that's why you want to buy mana over sandbox. But from what I'm seeing, it looks like we should be safe. But I wouldn't do anything such as buying anymore until you see it get close to that 80 cents. Once it about once hit like 82 cents, that's when I buy in before the rally. Outside of that, I'd be safe. See how everything go. Let me know in the comments if you guys if you guys are buying any mana or not. Hit the subscribe button. Talk to y'all soon.